Hey guys, Sean B. Martin here with Mission 3, Episode 3 of Defense Grid The Awakening. We're doing Ancient Research on Story Challenge Mode, and as you may have noticed, I have not played this one yet on Story Challenge Mode. I kind of cheated you guys last time. This is the research facility where, where I was uploaded. My body is somewhere. Ah, well, there's more to be left there of most people my age, I suppose. Does this guy sound like Patrick Stewart to anyone else? Increased firepower, range, that sort of thing. You can get the hang of it. Okay, so uh, we now have a tactical recon view. That's what that little bar at the top is called. It shows you when enemies are going to come out of the gate. So here comes a little swarm, and then another little swarm, and then uh, a group of three, and then a difficult group of three. That's why they're yellow. Uh, red will be bosses. Oh, I guess it wasn't three. It was a small group of tanks, is what that was. And they've added a new tower, but I haven't built any yet. I just, uh, I, the placement for these is too nice. I'm gonna put the new tower, which is a laser, in the back here, because it has a good Nice big range. I'm actually going to use one here first. Yes. To die. Cool. Dead. Laser. Laser. Sorry, I had to. I'm going to put some guns up here on this little perch, and then uh, this is the first time you get to see uh, me. I'm going to be able to direct where they go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one here and put one here and then they'll be forced to walk up and around if you block it if you try and put three across or something they're just going to walk between the towers but they will walk around them if they can so you can direct the way that they're going yeah get them get them get them burn them burn them look at them look at them they're on fire <laughs> that's why i put that laser tower right there instead of over here the more you know. Come on, guys. I need some more money. Oh, I can upgrade towers now. That's what I want to do first. Here's where it's going to get tricky. Those cores are getting awfully close to the exit. Okay, new flamethrower, please. Inferno, level two. Can do it. Are you sure? Okay, I think we're safe. Whew. Okay, I wish those were a little bit further away, though. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll upgrade these towers before I start building over there. Follow my own advice. I'm gonna build a level 2 gun tower, but I wanna wait till these swarms pass so this level 1 can make the most of the last minutes of its life. Not bad, not bad at all. See what a difference upgrading one tower made? Barely any in that wave got by. And last tower, how many got by? Eight. Uh, I'm gonna build a gun up here. And I will upgrade that gun as soon as I have the money. If you get the chance to shape the enemy's path by placing towers, do so. Do so. Thank you. No, that is good advice. I'm making fun of him, but... <laughs> okay, I can upgrade this tower now. Uh-oh. It's happened. Ah, crap. Okay, I've already lost one. But I have a feeling that this is going to start happening, so this time I'm leaving it in. I'll still get through the mission. I don't think I'm going to lose them all. At least I hope not. I hope I'm better than get that. Our back. They've already taken one. Yeah, 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 I know. I'm sorry. I'm not perfect. This is challenge mode. It's going to be difficult. I'll get better. And I might try these again offline. Try and get a perfect score for some achievements. You know, obsessed compulse about it a little bit. Does that make sense? Obsessed compulse? Is that the verb version of obsessed? I'm going to stop now. Let 
I gotta upgrade that laser. That's what I gotta do. But uh, the laser is 400. 400? Yeah, it's 400. Wow, I'm barely making a dent. I need more guns. I think I've mismanaged this. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. Things get... I don't want to say easier, but your strategy certainly takes a better shape once you can make temporal guns. Temporal guns slow down waves of enemies. And then you can really lay into them while they stand in one place, and that, that makes a huge difference. Heads up. They've taken a call. I know. Come on, kill these guys. Easy money. Gotta upgrade my laser. 300. 400, okay. <sighs> okay, I feel a little bit better. That'll really make a big difference. Also, its range goes the whole way out to... to... there. Burn him! <laughs> Very nice. Okay, I think I'll throw another Inferno Tower here, since I have the money. <laughs> that was nice. Oh, I got two of them there. We got one back. Okay, wave seven. Okay. I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna upgrade this. And then I'm gonna upgrade these. That should happen in a second. There we go. And next I'm gonna upgrade that. It's gonna be upgrade time. Up. Oh, if you look up in the bar there, you can see that there is a boss coming. Wave 9 is one boss. And like I said, a boss can carry three cores, so if you don't defeat it, it's a big chunk of your cores. Upgrade! And I will tear the bar boss apart mostly with the laser. And I'll probably build another one right here if I get the money. Which I won't. <laughs> Something new coming in. I need 200 for the laser. Alright, let's take a look at it. This is the Crasher. This is the only type of boss that I've seen so far. But I haven't played that far ahead in the game. And let's just watch its health bar move at normal speed. Okay, got that laser in there. Hmm. <laughs> Not great. Let's speed it up and watch how it does. These guys will get killed. Laser time. That'll be some easy money for dealing with the boss. And how's he doing up here? Okay, he's at about half health and he's halfway through the maze, so we'll probably be fine. I added this laser. Alright, I think we got him. And the rest of the guys will clean up on the way back. And the uh, boss drops 500 resources. So, taking one down is really, really worth it. So I upgraded that laser, I added another inferno tower, and I added a gun. 